welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Legoland 3 TV News, The Hourglass. I'm your host, Mike Griffin. Today, we're talking to Skunkman and Minky. Here to save the day! You can sit down. So, you both consider yourselves superheroes. Uh -huh, uh -huh, oh, uh -huh, yes! Uh -huh. Were you appointed to that position by the mayor? Uh, uh, um, not to uh, my uh, knowledge. Uh, 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 so when did you both decide to become superheroes? When we realized we could save the city. How did you become... Oh wait, I know the answer. Come, Minky, we must save the city. Yes, Crunk Man. There goes two more. Weren't you both in the asylum at one point? <laughs> the loony bin. We were in there because our arch nemesis tricked us into being captured and placed in there. Who's your arch nemesis? Professor Guna. So, I've heard some people say that they've seen you come walking down the street talking in gibberish. It's not gibberish. It's Tuckerlingo. Tucker what? No, they are definitely some odd fellers. You fool it. Anyway, that's all for now, folks. Join us next time for the next... We haven't shown you our stinkmobile yet. What is this thing doing in my studio? It can go on air, land, or water. These laser cannons on the front can zap just about anything. Can they destroy anything? We don't know. The door is over here. Here's my special escape system. And our skunk spray engine on the back. Don't worry, it's vaporized. <laughs> Tune in next time for the next edition of the Hourglass, showing you all the weirdos in Lego City. And the wings fire from the sides. You're paying for that. Good night, folks.